Hey guys, it's Tammy TKD Gal here and welcome back to my channel. I am here today to give you guys a review slash first impressions of the Sally Hansen Miracle Gel Gel Nail Polish System. But first, before we get into that, let's look at my own nails today. So today I have on um, actually another Sally Hansen polish. Um, this is the Triple Shine in Dive In. And then on my ring finger here, I have like a glittery, um, what do you call it? Glittery kind of flaky kind of a top coat here on this finger. And it is from the Wet n Wild Mega Last. And it is in the shade, what is this called? I Saw a Comet. And just look at that glittery, flaky goodness. It's a really good top coat for this shade right here. Um, it kind of goes really well. Here is the dive-in shade, too. It's just a cream finish. Kind of that aqua color that everybody seems to have a shade of. So, let's get into it. Okay, so first, I bought the kit um, that was $14.99 at my local Walgreens. I threw out the packaging, sorry, but I bought the pink kit, and this pink one is in uh, Pretty Piggy. So Pretty Piggy is the first shade that I ex decided to experiment with. And it looks like it's just kind of like your basic creamy pink color, but when you wear it and swatch it, it is more like a pinky, but it has like um a uh, coral kind of undertone underneath and I do have a swatch of it and then just because it was so beautiful I bought a second shade and I bought this shade here which is called Hunger Flames and this is kind of it's a it's a magenta slash purple and it's got this purple or fuchsia flash duochrome in it it is so pretty it is so gorgeous is even more gorgeous on the nails of course I have swatches for you guys so here is hunger flames right here ignore the rest of the wheel please uh, this is hunger flames and this is piggy polish or what is this pink piggy pretty piggy <laughs> this is pink pr uh, piggy so first off I'm gonna talk about the formula so the formula on these are very very nice whoops and very very nice they're very very opaque like I could um, I almost could get away with one coat on the pink one um, it's kind of a thicker formula than the normal uh, complete salon manicures because that's the kind of shape these look like they're in so that's what I compared it to little bit of a thicker formula but not completely like you know way out of left field okay you would almost think that you just had a regular polish um, that, that you were using so I painted my nails um, you're not supposed to use a base coat with this this is considered step one and you don't use a base coat and then of course you have the uh, top coat which is self-curing now Sally Hansen and I'm just gonna read from their website what they say about it it says it's a two-step system up to 14 days of color and shine easy removal no light needed the only true two-step gel manicure with no light needed over 45 shades you know blah 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 all right so um, what I did was you know it was kind of weird I was worried about like staining on my nails you know because you got this color on here and you know is it gonna stain my nails because I'm not using a base coat I didn't have any issues with staining or anything like that um, it went on beautifully it, it really is a nice polish to use on your nails I really did enjoy that part um, the removal was easy um, the wear time okay so here's the thing when you when you use these polishes you have to paint your nails properly um, which means that you know you should be capping the free the free edge if you have anything over the free edge um, and you want to do that with all layers meaning 
two coats of the base and color and then two coats of this top coat if you use these two together and you paint your nails properly and you're not um, doing anything with your hands that has like super harsh chemicals or anything like that and you're not using your nails to like you know chip off paint or anything like that it it will last I did not wear them for 14 days because I just I'm a polish fanatic I can't wear one polish on my nails for 14 days um, I did wear it for a good eight days um, and what I noticed was right around day six I started to notice tip wear around my nails and I know that's because I didn't apply it properly um, I did not cap the free edge I'm really bad about doing that in all of my nail polishing <laughs> I really don't cap the free edge enough um, because I, it gets real sloppy I'm not good at it I'm just gonna be honest I'm not good at it I get it all on my fingertips underneath here and everything so ugh, whatever I didn't do it um, but I didn't do it and I still got eight days of wear with no chipping and it was shiny and it was glorious it didn't fade it, it was beautiful it was great um, I really do like this um, I will buy more of these I would recommend trying it um, <clears throat> the curing so I mean you don't have to do anything special I mean you could treat this like putting on a regular top coat and you know you're done um, I tried to do my nails you know when it was daylight out and I was outside you know soon after I painted the nails so I don't know if that helped with the curing process or what have you I don't know if the results would have been the same had I not gone outside I don't know but it says that you don't need a light and it just cures in natural light so um, it didn't say that it you know it wouldn't cure like if you're in the house or something like that versus going outside I didn't see any real difference and I used um, and I used both polishes so I polished my nails um, twice using the same kind of method and everything and I am I'm really surprised I really do like them I I really like them but I like Sally Hansen polishes anyway you know I, I anytime they come out with something new I tend to get it and I tend to like it for the most part except for that whole hoo-ha about um, the extreme wear and the uh, what is it the Pacific blue oh my goodness you would think okay we're not gonna go on there but anyway so um, I really do like these polishes. I probably will pick up a couple more because I've already been looking at like uh, some of the blue ones. They look really, really pretty. And there's this like orangey mango-y color that looks really, really nice that I want to try too. So hopefully, um, you know, you guys will be seeing that. And then I think that's it. I think that's... Um that's all I can say about these uh, polishes so if you guys have picked them up and you've tried them please leave your comments down below so we can all kind of bounce off each other with each other's experiences um, and let me know what your thoughts were and thank you for watching and all of my new subscribers I really appreciate you guys I read each and every one of your comments so thank you so much for leaving them and I will see you guys in the next video Bye.